should see a hundred chart as your next page in your packet. So that's what I'd like you to look at right now. Okay, I asked you to keep out your orange crayon. I would also, in addition to keeping out your orange crayon, I would like you to take out your green crayon. So please take out your green crayon as well. So in front of you, you should have an orange and a green crayon. In front of you, you should have an orange and a green crayon. Today you will learn how to identify even and odd numbers. Today you're going to learn how to identify even and odd numbers. Some of these numbers on your 100 chart are even numbers and some are odd numbers. Let's see if we can find all of the even numbers and all of the odd numbers. Okay, you're going to lightly color the first number orange. What number will we color? Daniela? One. One. Please lightly color one. Oh, I wanted orange, not blue. Notice I'm just coloring it lightly. Now when I color it, you're not going to be able to see the numbers when I color it on my hunter chart, but you should still be able to see it on yours. Okay? We'll lightly color the second number green. What color will, or what number will we color green? Logan? Number two. Two. We'll color the next number orange. What number will we color? Braxton? Three. Three. We'll lightly color our next number green. What number will we color? Sophia, what number will we color? I didn't hear you, honey. Four. We'll lightly color our next number orange. What number will we color? Baden? No, Baden needs to do his own thinking. Five. We'll lightly color our next number green. What number will we color? Kira? Six. We'll lightly color our next number orange. What number will we color? Mario? Seven. We'll lightly color our next number green. What number will we color? Melina? Eight. We'll color our next number orange. What number will we color, Eli? Nine. We'll color our next number green. What number will we color, Abram? Ten. We'll color our next number orange. What number will we color, Logan? But what number will we color? Yes, I am doing a pattern. Yes, I'm going to color it orange, but what number? Eleven. I'm going to color my next number green. What number will I color? Adeline. Twelve. Okay. Each time we color one number green, we color the next number orange, and then the next number green, and the next number orange. You should have noticed that we're coloring a pattern. Okay? What I would like for you to do so I'd like for you to finish coloring your 100 chart in this same pattern. Some of you may find the quickest way to do it. There is a quick way to do it. What is the quickest way to do this? Hey, bro. Color the way down. Exactly. So if I color all of these going down, notice how quickly I can color that and do all my other oranges going down. So go ahead and finish coloring in your 100 chart orange and green. Color lightly, please. You still want to be able to read your numbers. Some people who are already done with their greens, they're already done with their oranges. Nice job doing this quickly.
Okay, we're not talking. We're not talking. You need to finish coloring your number or your hundred chart. We're not talking. Faden. Abby, we're not talking. Okay, here, Abby, you don't need to worry about here. You need to worry about Abby's paper. finish up while we are doing this. So what I would like for you to do now, you'll notice that yes, we did make a pattern. We made an A, B repeating pattern. We have orange, green, orange, green, and so on and so forth. Okay, so let's point to our green numbers. At, please point to our green numbers. Everybody point to the green numbers. Everybody's pointing to the green numbers, and we're going to say our green numbers together as we point to them. And we will stop. Please stop talking. Let's say our green numbers together. Yes, I went now. Sorry. That's okay. Okay, green numbers, here we go, point, and let's read them, here we go, we're going to go across, here we go, two, two four, four, six, six eight, eight, slow ten, down, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-six, please don't, no, stop. The, this will only work if we're pointing to the numbers. You have to point. So point to 38 and let's begin from 38. Here we go. 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, 100. Okay? We say that our numbers that we colored green, we say that the numbers that we colored green are our odd number, I'm sorry, even numbers. I apologize. So underneath your 100 chart, underneath your 100 chart, it says green and then it says blank numbers. On that line, you need to write the word even. On that line, you need to write the word even. E-V-E-N. It says green, hyphen, even number. You're writing even. Okay? So our green numbers are our even numbers. What do you notice? What do you notice about my even numbers? What digits do they all have in them? Look at your even numbers. What digits do all of my even numbers have in them? Mel Marie or Melena? Two, four, six, and eight. Two, four, six, and eight, and then a zero. Right? So if zero were on my hundred chart, where would I add zero if it were on my hundred chart? If zero is an even number, where would I add it on my hundred chart? Would I put it over here? Or would I put it up here? I would add my zero above my 10. Okay, let's point to, well, 
Well, actually, so let's go back. Look up here. I'm going to write our even numbers from 0 to 20. 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Those are our even numbers to 20. Okay, let's point to our orange numbers. Let's point to our orange numbers. Let's read our orange numbers. Here we go. You have to point to them because these numbers are a little bit more unnatural as we're counting. Here we go. One, three, five, seven, nine, eleven, keep going, thirteen, fifteen, seventeen, nineteen, twenty-one, twenty-three, twenty-five, twenty-seven, twenty-nine. 